Hello writers, I'm Kristen Taylor. I'm the one that Andrea and Marion have introduced to you as the new uh, senior editor for Ansley Writers Forum and I'm so excited to join you in this role. I've actually been writing for Ansley for the last few years, all the way back from when Aaron Crisp was the editor. And um, I think what I resonate most with with Ansley Writers is their mission to elevate women's voices in the Wesleyan tradition. And that's a heritage that I am so excited to have and a mission that I can really get behind. And thanks to Marion and her work this last year, we now have a beautiful platform on which to share your stories and your voices. And as Marion and Andrea um, mentioned in their introduction, of me, I actually come from a higher ed background. And so as I step into this role as the senior editor for the next leg of the journey, uh, I really want to bring to you the resources that I have as a professor of creative writing and um, nonfiction writing uh, to really help you learn and grow and blossom as a writer and go deeper in your writing practice. Um, I'm trying to think, what else did I want to share? With oh, so to that end, um, every month uh, we're going to send you a little three to five minute video that will have another writing tip, uh, just like this, where I will be sharing with you something that will hopefully encourage you or give you some new insight along your writing journey. And that will come with three to five writing prompts that you can engage and will help get the creative juices flowing and help you really jump in and begin to express some of your experience as a woman and a woman of faith in modern society. So look forward to that. That should start at the beginning of April, and like I said, we'll do that monthly. Um, but before I leave, I want to leave you just with this insight about why do we write for Ansley Writers? And I believe we write because we um, are part of a tradition that celebrates us as women, as valid and um, valuable uh, contributors to our the spiritual realm, the church body, and the worldly realm. And so we share and write in order to uh, share our insights, our wisdom, our stories, but we also write for Ansley Writers because we want to send a clear message to the women who are coming up behind us and who are around us that there is a place for them to share their voices and their insights as well. I have for the last eight years uh, been a part of integrating arts into worship and so um, I write poems for worship services and at our very first church where I had started doing this the artisan director and I were talking about what we do on the platform with arts and he said you know Kristen we write our poems, we do our fit short films, we do our skits and our dances, not only because we're trying to integrate arts into worship and open up new avenues of worship for our congregants, but because when we do that, there are people in the congregation who God has blessed with certain talents and gifts, and they don't know that there's a place for them until they see us up on that platform doing this work. And when they do, they say to themselves, oh, I can do that, and they know uh, that there is a place for them to express these God-given gifts and talents. And so I think that's true for us at Ansley Writers as well, that we are writing uh, because we want to send a clear message to the women coming up in our tradition and beyond, that there is a place for them, they are valued, that their voices count and matter, and there's space for them to come share their God-given gifts and talents and abilities. All right, that's all for now. Um, please feel free to drop me a note, say hello. I would love to meet you individually. I will certainly be meeting you um, as the weeks go on and helping you um, work with your writing and uh, take the next step on this writing journey. Thanks so much. Bye.